Hey everybody, today I'm going to be doing a first impressions video on my brand new Mission FZ0 roller hockey skates. So I'll just go ahead and show them to you. I took all the wrapping out for filming, sake of filming. So uh, just get all the skates out here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go over all the specs of them and all the reasons why I bought them and over other skates and just everything about the skates. So. Starting down with the wheels, the wheels are Lebeda Addictions. They're my favorite wheel and out of all the wheels. I've tried Rink Rats, Lebeda, all different Lebedas, and lots of wheels. So these are my favorite wheels, and they're really gri grippy and nice. And they also have the Mission Swiss LE bearings, which are really nice bearings as well. That's what I have on my Mission Haler AC1s. And... Those are really nice bearings. I've had them for a long time, and they're just really nice. So, all new uh, for the Mission Inhaler NLS-1 and the FZ-0. Those are the only two Mission skates that have the Kryptonium chassis. So, these and the previous line, top line skate. So, this is a relatively new chassis design for Mission. And I've personally never had these chassis. I've had the Magnesium chassis that uh, they offered on the DS1 and the AC1 roller hockey skates. And yeah, so I'm excited to try those. You can take a look at the wheels and chassis here. Really nice. like how it looks a lot. And also, I think this is the first skate that's ever had a curved composite boot construction. So this is a new material. It's very stiff. It's not as stiff as the top of the line Bowers, the 1XRs, but it's very stiff. Um, I personally don't like a rock hard skate, so I went with these. And the tongue, I'll show you the tongue real quick. It's a five piece felt tongue, true vent tongue. So. Um, here, let me unlace this a little. Show you the venting in the tongue. It's got a bunch of perforations, holes in the tongue. So, show you that. Right there, that's just so air can come through it and ventilate your foot. I don't really feel like the inhaler stuff really does much, but... It looks cool either way. So it has black inhaler toe cap opposed to my AC ones with white toe caps. And it's got a venting port on both sides. So um, the outsoles, I'll show you the outsoles. Let me get the other skate. Don't know why they put stickers on the outsole still. So outsole looks very nice. It's like carbon fiber, but it's not. Um, I put a &R laces. Oh, no, I put Elite laces on Elite waxed laces on these skates. And I've never had uh, a &R laces. And I just got some, and they left wax all over my skates. So I took them off, put some Elite laces on, and had no problems. So far, we'll see how that is once I ride them. I'm sure it's going to be the same as my other skates since I have ANRs on my other skates as well. So, yeah. Um, I'll show you the inside of the skate here and the footbeds while I'm in there. So here's the beautiful inside of the skate. Looks so awesome. Um, show you the footbeds. I do have a concern with these footbeds that when you put your foot in so far, every time I've tried them on, you have to untie the skate a lot more than I normally have to because it grips to my foot and then bunches up at the front of the skate so that's one concern I have with the 
grip fit foot beds. So, um, and finally, why I bought these skates. Uh, first, I want to show you all the heel chip. Not really heel chips. They're uh, ten guard chips and quarter package chips right there and right here. So I want to show you all the colors that you get when you buy the skates. So you get yellow and orange, yellow or orange and yellow. You get purple and white. You get blue and red. You get um, two of the big white and purple ones. But then you also get the ones that are on the skates, which are gray, looks white, but it's gray, and teal, which is the rest of the color of the skate. So I'll be riding these skates very soon. Um, Finally, why I bought the, these skates over, for say, the Bauer 1XR skates. So, I have wide feet, and a lot of the skates are just way too narrow for me. And they widened these skates when they made this new line, and the Bowers are still narrow. They're Bauer Vapors, which are lo the lowest volume skate and the narrowest skate. So, they're really narrow, and they just don't work for me. So, and I like mission. So, that's why I went with the missions. And I gave the NLS skates a try last, for the last uh, line, which was the line before the FC series. And they're just way too narrow. They didn't work. My mom and my dad both got some as well. And just did not work. They were way too narrow very uncomfortable they were punched and baked multiple times and didn't work so and I just also as a bonus wanted to show you my mom got some FZ3 roller hockey skates very nice um, if you guys want me to make a full video on these skates I can just comment below and I will if I get very many people commenting so, yeah, very nice skates as well. So, if you enjoyed this video or learned something, make sure you like it, subscribe, and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Bye.